when we lost our purpose, uh, not being able to do events, we wanted to make sure when we came back that we did events with purpose. We were informed that, you know, we were going to be sharing our location with, um, with Hope Mission. Uh, they were going to have one of their uh, shelters and outreach programs uh, located uh, next door to us. And, you know, we thought it was very important. We made sure we were going to make a donation and also engage with the population and create jobs for them and be part of the experience. We didn't just make a donation, we actually engaged, which is very important, you know. Um, it, it meant a lot to us and our team, and I think a lot of the consumers, uh, you, you know, like being part of an event with purpose. Boyle Street Community Services is a local nonprofit to the city of Edmonton. We are non-denominational and harm reduction based and we have over 10 locations in the city of Edmonton. We offer over 40 programs, and we serve everyone from pregnant parents to children, youth, families, adults, and seniors. So a wide variety of services uh, offered to a wide variety of people, and really our, our mission and vision at Boyle Street is to empower people to break the cycle of poverty and homelessness and build stronger and more inclusive communities. Giving proceeds back is one thing, but we're also hiring people from those organizations to help put the event together. So we've got some of the members helping with our table setups and with our garbage cleanup, and you know, and everyone's got a smile on their face because everyone's part of something bigger than themselves. Being a part of an event like this that is choosing to support Boyle Street and bringing those moments of joy, that sense of community care to not just our community but to the broader Edmontonians, it's incredibly valuable to us because we see it every day with our community members when we have access to things that bring us joy and bring us dignity. So we're just, we're grateful to be involved in an event like this. You know, we work with the Edmonton Rock and Roll Society and help them with their fundraising efforts for their Center for Arts and Music for Vulnerable Children, a great after school program that got kids engaged with music. That to us, it's like, when we're doing our events, we know we're doing something special and we're, we're giving back to the community. I think a lot of people work in our industry because it makes them feel good. They're part of something bigger than them. And uh, you know, there's no job too big or too small. It's, we all work as a team and without everybody working collectively together, you do not have a festival. You do not have an industry that supports live music. For us to come roaring back uh, this last summer and to continue to do what we do is, uh, you know, we don't take that for granted and, you know, there's been a lot of reflection before the shows and after the shows and, you know, we were really lucky to do what we get, get to do. Bringing people back together to enjoy music was, was incredible.